Hello friends, how are you? Today we have received something from Epson, which is their EcoTank L3250, uh, which is an EcoTank ink tank system where the printing cost and everything will be less as compared to if you are taking a printer without the ink tank. So I will strongly suggest everyone if you are buying a printer in the market for the printer, you should definitely go for ink tank uh, system printer and uh, I will definitely recommend Epson because it exceeds your vision and they have nice quality products available in the market as compared to the other brands which we also have in ink tank system so this is a ink tank system and let's look at the features that this L3250 offers from the box itself so it has a A4 size printing up to a A4 size printing then we have a copy scan in A4 size we have a Wi-Fi connection available it has a rear paper input as well as well as mobile print so you just have to download an app and then you can uh, instruct the app uh, to put, do your uh, stuff and everything so the app is also showcased here as it's called as Epson smart panel and it can do a lot of stuff from print documents to scan to everything using your uh, uh, smartphone you don't need a laptop or something of that sort so this is how the package looks like and uh, so we have this uh, box called uh, eco tank three two five zero so we have our unboxing live ready and we are going to open it um, the seals and then take out the printer from the same so this printer has come at the right time because the school has just started and then we definitely need uh, things to print like the labels and everything hopefully I will be able to do it using this printer or all the exercise books that uh, my children wanted so this is how the package is let's check out the package contents so this is how the thing looks like and it says that open read the instructions and everything so this is a new package new printer we have received so the printer has a lot of accessories so basically we have got uh, five ink packages inside which we need to refill the tank with so we have got yellow magneta uh, shine and black colored inks and we have also got an extra black ink in case of emergencies because most of the printing is done in the black color so these are the five inks that we have and the capacity ink capacity of all these bottles is uh, 65 ml so these are 65 ml bottles that they have packaged separately and along with one free black bottle in black color which is also extra 65 ml so moving keeping the bottles aside Let's move on to the printer. So other than that, I think uh, in the package we have these thermocoles to protect the printer. So this is how the printer looks like. We'll see now. Let's take this uh, protective film out and then we will be able to see the printer in its full glory. So this is how the printer is. It's really lightweight. Uh, it's definitely a printer for home because it's uh, it can be easily carried um, and stored away. And uh, this is the printer that we have got so but somehow the cable is missing inside this printer so we'll have to find an alternative as to what kind of uh, connection do we have here and so this is the printer that we have and so somebody has already done some things with the printer says so they have printed something it says match words with the correct pictures and which is a really nice exercise they have a center so we'll keep the car inside only so i think the printer it looks like this one and uh, because this was just a scanning job that they have done so that's why the cable is not there so this is the printer it has buttons on the top as you will be able to see we have the power on button then we have uh, a button to tell whether wi-fi is connected or not and various other buttons as well which we're going to see now and then these are the ink tanks that we have got so we will check out the manuals as to how the whole uh, printer works like and they have specifically marked the ink tank uh, this is a black yellow magneta and cyan so these are the things that we have to do take care of and then they have uh, all these stickers and everything printed and this is the back door uh, i think this is a back door uh, entry by which the paper will be get feed into the printer and this is a normal uh, i think mp3 player or cassette player power cable that they require so we will find one and then we will connect the same and also they have a usb which is a different kind of usb they want if you want to connect your documents and everything 
so this is a very 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 basic uh, printer multifunctional printer uh, from Epson and with four inks that we have to insert so this is how you will access the ink tank and um, as you will see you have uh, they have mentioned that this is 103 black so basically you take uh, open the things and then you can start inserting the inks into the printer so that's what we are going to do now so let's start with the black ink so they have a slot by which you can cut uh, they are vacuumly packed because um, it's like really sealed pack so it makes it easy and then once you open the thing uh, so these are the slots that are there so basically you have to so this the first ink is a black you can make the combination so this is a black black so you have to put the ink like this don't be afraid just push it and then only the ink will start filling so you will see the ink has started flowing and uh, I'll show you now so you will see the ink is slowly getting filled inside the chamber so we'll do this exercise for all the inks I think the tank capacity is around uh, uh, 70 70 ml or something like that because almost whole of this uh, 65 ml bottle is finished so we'll shift to the other inks and then we'll fill the ink tank fully this is the amount of ink that's left so it's basically 5 ml or something of that sort So as you know I'm a fan of uh, fountain pen inks as well so basically yellow is one of the inks that is definitely required in your arsenal if you want to create a mixture of uh, different kinds of uh, colors and uh, it helps to create a lot of colors in fountain pens as well as uh, in the normal printing as well so this is just the mixing of different kinds of inks. so these are the basic colors that they definitely want to create a lot of colorful things as you can see in this chart there is a multiple of colors that they have produced uh, red blue orange pink and so many so much more designs can be produced um, uh, using the printer so printer has a lot of power and definitely needs it needs to be there in your home for your kids and everything so this is definitely a worth uh, choice in case you want to test it out so I'm going to test it out now so let's see how how what I, I can do with this one and uh, what printing I should do for my kids as well as for myself to plan for 2024 so taking the ink out is really easy once it's filled and the, uh, the sound of water flowing stops you should just uh, take it out and there is no leakage or something of that sort because the mechanism of this bottle and everything is really unique and uh, I think Epson I have not used any other ink tank uh, printer as yet so this is how the e how easy is it to fill this mechanism and all so once you have done it you can close the thing but the upper portion can gets only closed if you take out the flap of uh, the scan mechanism and then then it gets fitted here so basically now the ink is full in all the four compartments so we will have to find a cable and then uh, we can uh, uh, on the system and then also install the app these are all the documents that were there in the package so it says that you have to take out the sticky stickies from uh, the printer so we will check out if all the stickies has been taken because we could find one of the stickies sticking somewhere here so we'll take it out friends as there was something sticking on one of the sides so I opened this frontal panel so you can just drop it down and then you can take it uh, take this out and then you will see there is a sticky which we need to take out uh, for the printer before we start on the printer so printer mechanism is uh, all electronics inside and then the serial number is also mentioned here so basically that is how the whole things looks like and then uh, you can close it and then you can fold this packet so i was wrong that you need to have cover the flap it can directly be closed eco tank uh, can be directly be closed and if in case your paper jams or something you have this tray also but you should keep it uh, closed in case there is no problem then this is the manual that uh, told us how to open and everything so you have to take out all the one two three four stickers and then you can open the thing and you have to check out they're the same steps which we showed you uh, in the video they have told us so these are the various uh, uh, instruction manual that they have provided in the thing along with that they have a, a notice uh, by by Epson corporation in case you have some things and then they have also provided us with a software disk in case your software is not um, you have one you don't have internet connection so then you need a cd dvd player 
of some sort so that you can download the softwares using this uh, this disc compact disc so then then we have the radio equipment information manual then we have our epson information booklet let's see the information booklet so this information booklet is kind of a package uh, page uh, which is folded uh, four times so let's see they have written in multiple languages as you will be able to see we don't uh, need to read it so the next is uh, they have a uh, um, manual for different series here we have l3250 series so basically this is the manual for us and the same kind of manual is provided in different languages and uh, there are so many languages because the printer gets sold in multiple countries so we don't need to read um, the other languages that uh, they have provided we'll definitely check out the english language manual so this is this is the thing so they have uh, a printer a cable windows this and the inks and the other manuals so we didn't get the power cable in this package somehow it got missed or misplaced so we have to plug on the printer then you have to uh, you don't have to connect uh, you cannot connect this power cable into uh, the power needs to be provided from the power outlet not from your usb port and if you have a smart uh, device you have to go to section 2 and then you have to download this epson smart panel uh, panel uh, device by which uh, you will be able to control this printer uh, uh, using your wireless system and then and then uh, this is the step that they have told us as to fill the inks and everything we did it already and uh, uh, the the ink portal went straight into the port and then it gets filled we don't need to anyth do anything and then automatically in 50 seconds the ink tank gets filled so the first time the ink tank is full and uh, on the printer it said that uh, you can print a lot of uh, things so the next step of this thing is continuously they are telling us everything and then after switching on we have to switch on the thing and uh, uh, we'll, it will get connected and uh, then it's the printer will be ready to do so we will um, do a separate uh, video on how to do a uh, guide to control panel and everything so we'll do a separate uh, printing uh, video on the same and it's very really easy to set up uh, as far as i know um, it will be really easy to set up once we have the app installed on the system so thank you very much epson for sending us this uh, uh, nice wi-fi enabled l3250 eco tank uh, printer for review and uh, i'll definitely uh, find a cable and connect it um, and then start using the same and i will share whatever i print uh, on this thing so thank you very much to the from the from the top and everything the build quality is really nice and it's really easy to carry even kids uh, can uh, uh, carry it from one room to another but uh, uh, generally you should not carry it uh, uh, in multiple places because then the nozzle and everything gets disturbed and then uh, you need to uh, reset the same so thank you very much epson for the same and uh, looking forward to getting this device reviewed soon thanks a lot don't forget to share and subscribe to our channel we are very near 5000 mark and with your help only we are going to cross the same thanks a lot bye bye